Welcome back, Veteran X fam. Make sure you hit that subscribe button so you know the fact every time your boy drops a video, man. All right, coming to you today with uh, Jordan Lucas, Eminem. What if I told you I was gay, man? So, uh, hey, without any further ado, let's hop right into it. Let's see what this got, man. Some uh, unreleased stuff, look like. <laughs> What if I told you that I was different? What if I told you that something's missing? Mm. And what if I told you we're not alike in a way that I feel inside is different than what you picture? Mm. Oh, this about to be deep. It's about to be deep. What if I told you I feel divided? Mm. Keep to myself and I'm awfully quiet. And what if I told you I've been conflicted by my own thoughts, trapped in the dark and I try to hide it? No, I'm not a slave to no fucking fairy tale. I let you think that you know me very well. Oh, I'm not a slave to no fucking fairy tale, but they call gay people fairies. I don't know if he meant it like that, but. <laughs> I feel Keep to myself and I'm awfully quiet. And what if I told you I've been conflicted by my own thoughts, trapped in the dark, and I try to hide it? No, I'm not a slave to no fucking fairy tale. Before we go any further, man, I don't care. Uh, what sexuality you are, bro? It's all about uh your character. I judge people by by the uh their character, not by the color of their skin. So let's get that uh out the air before we even start this. I should have said it earlier, but I don't care what color you are, bro. As long as you a decent human being, that's all I care about. Trapped in the dark, and I try to hide it. No, I'm not a slave to no fucking fairy tale. I let you think that you know me very well. Mm. Make no mistake, this is not a cry for help, cause I don't owe no one no explanation on how I feel, but on Facts, bro. It sounds like uh Jonah Lucas like coming out. Uh he like talking um like uh a point of view of somebody that's coming out the closet. Uh I don't know, I guess he like talking to Eminem or talking to us. It sound like he like you talking to like a friend or something like that. Make no mistake, this is not a cry for help, cause I don't all know it, no explanation on how I fail. But on the rail, what if I told you that I was brave? I grew up different than I was raised. Mm. But still, what if I told you I'm out of place? Wait, what if I told you that I was gay? He felt out of place his whole life. He playing a role for society, but he feel. You know, however you want to feel. His true self. What if I told you that I was gay? What if I told you I'm not alright? Mm. I mean, I don't feel dead, but I'm not alive. What if I told you I'm not alright? I'm not dead. What do you say I'm not dead, but I'm not alright? What if I told you I'm not alright? I mean, I don't feel dead, but I'm not alive. What do you say I feel dead, but I'm not alive? What if I told you I'm not alright? I mean, I don't feel dead, but I'm not alive. Mm. What if I told you I'm not like you and the shit I've been going through, it'll probably make you cry. Mm, this is deep, bro. This is deep. Somebody is like feeling the same way Jonah, I mean, you know, Jonah is portraying in this song. What if I told you I'm not like you and the shit I've been going through, it'll probably make you cry. Mm. What if I told you I'm not this and the person you think you know don't exist? Mm. Yeah, I'm not who you know, I'm not who you wish. I'm not who you want me to be. What you want from me isn't this. Oof. I grew up in church where I couldn't be myself. I grew up in church where I couldn't be myself. That's a, a big thing in the African American community, bro. Big thing in the African American community, bro. I know people grew up their whole lives um, in the closet just because of um, they're just afraid of what uh, people in church might say or might think, bro. But my advice to you guys, man, is uh, hey, do what you feel, man. 
It's between you and your God, bro. Like, don't worry about what anybody else think, bro. Like, at the end of the day, um, on Judgment Day, we're not going to have to look at any one of these people around here. We're going to have to look at the man upstairs. So, hey, do what makes you happy, man, and enjoy your life while you can. I felt like a prisoner, couldn't leave myself. They told me God. Uh, go back a little bit. Who you wish? I'm not who you want me to be. What you want from me isn't this. I grew up in church where I couldn't be myself. Thanks. I felt like a prisoner, couldn't leave myself. Mm, I felt like a prisoner, I couldn't leave myself. Mm, trapped in this closet and I couldn't get out. Same thing. In church where I couldn't be myself. I felt like a prisoner, couldn't leave myself. They told me God don't like ugly, and it's an ugly world. And if I ever seen things different, then I would burn in hell. And all bro, fat. I said, God don't like ugly, but it's an ugly world. The world is full of judgment, bro. Full of judgment. You gotta, like gotta, ugly, you gotta brush that shit out for real. Ugly world, and if I ever seen things different, then I would burn in hell. And on the rail, this is not new. This is mm, not if I go against the grain, I'm a burning hell. If I don't go against the norm of being straight, if I do anything else, you know, bisexual, anything, pansexual, gay, whatever, transsexual, whatever, like, if I go against the grain, I'm going to hell for it. And if I ever seen things different, then I would burn to hell. And on the rail, this is not new, this is not a phase. I grew up different than I was raised. Mm -hmm. But still, what if I... I grew up different than I was raised. I was raised to like women. I was raised, but I grew up to like a man or a woman, obviously. Uh, whatever spectrum you on. Hey, dope, bro. It's not a phase. I grew up different than I was raised. But still, what if I told you I'm out of place? Wait. What if I told you that I was gay? If I told you I was out of place in this world, out of place, bro, it's tough, bro. It's, it's tough. Gay. What if I told you that I was gay? Bro, well, my friend told me he or she was gay. Like, I wouldn't, I mean, I wouldn't care. Hey. I still, hey, you still my friend. I still love you regardless. I don't care. Whatever makes you happy. What if I told you I'm homophobic? Mm, I guess this is, uh, it's like, uh, damn. But the first line, it sounded like he was talking to his friend and his friend talking back to him. Which Eminem being the other friend that's, that, that's straight, obviously. You're homophobic, and you have zero control over your impulses. And your straight, straight man is 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 brought up or taught that you control your impulse and control if you want a man or you want a woman, same sex or a different sex partner. What if I told you I'm homophobic and you have zero control over your impulses and the genetic flaw in your chromosomes is the culprit? It's something I can The genetic flaw in your chromosomes is the culprit. Ooh. What if I told you I'm homophobic and you have zero control over your impulses and the genetic flaw in your chromosomes is the culprit? It's something I can't sugarcoat. It's repulsive. Mm, I said I can't sugarcoat the chromosome in your uh in your genetics. God, Lee. Flaw in your chromosomes is the culprit. It's something I can't sugarcoat. It's repulsive. And then, you know, they say if you got a little sugar in your tank, you gay. Like they used to say that. So like. It's the whole fucking play on that shit, bro. And the genetic flaw in your chromosomes is the culprit. It's something I can't sugarcoat. It's repulsive. We were homies. Since children, I thought it. I thought I was bumping, no, because we'd sit chilling, just talk chicks. Now, how can we be mm. friends still after all this unless I can convince you to repent as God to forgive you for your sins and begin healing your conscience? Mm. How can we be bored all this time? I'm just now knowing this. I didn't. We supposed to be cool, but I ain't know about I ain't know about this your whole life. We sit chilling, just talk chicks. Now how can we be friends still after all this unless I can convince you to repent as God to forgive you for your sins and begin healing your conscience? Mm. Rage you with a sick illness that causes it hard on me, which is you. Ooh, and that's hard, bro. Oh, uh, 
that's hard about thinking like uh, being homosexual is like a, a illness and a sickness instead of like a, a you know like just who you are bro it's not a it's not a sickness but that's the uh, stereotype Begin healing your conscience and read you with a sick illness that causes it. Part of me wishes you kept the shit still in the closet. I'm white. Mm. I'm getting mixed feelings like logic. I wish you would have kept that shit in the closet. Being uh, down low in the closet, bro. Wish you would have kept that shit in the closet. Wish you wouldn't have told me that shit. But he said, I'm getting mixed feelings like logic. I don't know if y'all remember, bro, when logic first said, nigga, in a song or live. He got mixed feelings. A lot of people didn't know he was mixed. A lot of people thought he was just white. <laughs> he got mixed feelings for saying that shit, for real. You kept the shit still in the closet, I'm white. But I'm getting mixed feelings like logic. Yeah, I'm pissed off a little. This is a choice. We were supposed to be boys. You're acting like this ain't up. He said this was a choice. Mmm. Yeah, I'm pissed off a little. This is a choice. We were supposed to be boys. You're acting like this ain't optional. What if I said you was weak? See, he's thinking it's a choice and it's not optional, but it's the way his his friend is feeling. This is a choice. We were supposed to be... His, his uh, Jordan Lucas character is actually, like, uh, living his true self. Mixed feelings like logic. Yeah, I'm pissed off a little. This is a choice. We were supposed to be boys. You're acting like this ain't optional. What if I said you was weak? Because you don't got the strength to conquer some biological monster that's part of you. It's what if I said you was weak because you don't have the strength to conquer some biological monster? Hmm. Your mind stronger than your willpower? Little, this is a choice. We were supposed to be boys. You're acting like this ain't optional. What if I said you was weak? Cause you don't got the strength mm. to conquer some biological monster that's part of you. It's responsible for them homosexual thoughts. Mm. You don't want to let your part like a sofa section as long as you make it. I said you don't want to sum apart like a, a sectional sofa. Cause you don't got the strength to conquer some biological monster that's part of you. It's responsible for them homosexual thoughts. You don't want to let your part like a sofa section as long as you mm. make it. You don't want to let a part. You don't want to let a part like a, like a, like a sectional. For them homosexual thoughts. You don't want to let your part like a sofa section as long. You don't want to let your part. Let your part. I know that one going on my head. I'll catch it. I'm gonna catch it one day. <laughs> it's responsible for them homosexual thoughts. You don't want to let your part like a sofa section as long as you make your decision and stand by it. But I can't be beside it. Because for me, that'd be next to impossible. Mm, I can't stand by it because that will be next to impossible. I literally can't stand by you because I don't believe in what you're saying. So that would be next to impossible for me to even, you know, you know, he telling a story. You don't want to let your part like a sofa section as long as you make... You don't want to legs apart. You don't want to legs apart. It's like he's saying legs apart, like legs. You don't want legs apart like a sectional sofa. That shit bugging me not getting that one. For them homosexual thoughts, you don't want to let your part like a sofa section as long as you make your decision and stand by it. But I can't be beside it because for me, that'd be next to impossible. Or you learn to control your urges. You say it's like pulling teeth and morals of oral surgeons. Mm. Like morals or oral surgeons, like pulling teeth, kind of trying to hold it. Decision and stand by it, but I can't be beside it. Because for me, that'd be next to impossible. Or you learn to control your urges. You say it's like pulling teeth and morals of oral surgeons. Mm. Why would you even know any ways that you're a virgin? Why can't like pulling teeth, morals of oral surgeons. All right, bro. Cause for me that'd be next to impossible Or you learn to control your urges You say it's like pulling teeth and morals of moral surgeons But how would you even know any ways if you're a virgin? Why can't you be a normal person? What if I tried steering you towards a girlfriend? They might say, why don't you be a normal person? Why don't I steer you next to a girlfriend? But what's normal, bro? What's normal? Maybe that is his normal Urges. You say it's like pulling teeth and morals of moral surgeons, but how would you even know any ways if you're a virgin? Why can't you be a normal person? What if I tried steering you towards a girlfriend? Mm. 
wouldn't work, would it? You seem pretty sure-footed, I'm sure good at judging, but I have no right. I know goodbye seems cold, right? Not even a flicker of hope like a straw. Damn, that man said, I know saying bye is cold, right? Hell yeah, that's cold, right? You about to chunk deuces to your friend? It's a girlfriend. Wouldn't work, would it? You seem pretty sure-footed. I'm sure good at judging, but I have no right. I know goodbye seems cold, right? Not mm. even a flicker of hope like a strobe light. Mm. Cause I leave in a Not even flicker of a hope like a strobe light? Seems cold, right? Shit. Not even a flicker of hope like a strobe light. Mm. So I leave and I swear I stayed up that whole night. And no, I didn't know you would go right home and go take your own life. Oh I my gosh. That means I stayed up this whole night and I didn't know you was gonna go home and take your own life. I guess his friend came to him and he didn't have the response. The M hit him with this fucked up ass response. Damn. Not even a flicker of hope like a strobe light. As I leave and I swear I stayed up that whole night. And no, I didn't know you would go right home and go take your own life. I mm. didn't mean for that shit to happen. I said I won't cry. I let the best friend that I've ever known die. Mm. Alone was going to tell you the next day. I'm so sorry. I'm fighting my own demons. I won't lie. They won't leave me alone. Eating at my soul this whole time. I've been tortured in prison. In my own mind. Born... I've been tortured in in prison in my own mind come on M. i'm so sorry i'm fighting my own demons i won't lie they won't leave me alone eating at my soul this whole time i've been tortured in prison in my own mind a born again christian but lord if you're listening we might be headed for a collision because mm. when i told my boy i couldn't support his decision i was trying to make it seem like a choice when it isn't mm, when i wasn't oh he talking to god now he said when i wasn't when i was talking to my boy man I tried to make it seem like it was a choice when it wasn't. When he was talking about he was being homosexual, I was, I was, I was, I was, I was um, making it seem like it was a choice that he had and not a decision. Born again Christian, but Lord, if you're listening, we might be headed for a solution. Because when I told my boy I couldn't support his decision, I was trying to make it seem like a choice when it isn't. Can't be cured with a prayer to St. Jude. Can't be cured with a prayer from St. Jude. Just trying to make it seem like a choice when it isn't. Can't be cured with a prayer to St. Jude. What if I told you my wish never came true? What if I'm a hypocrite who's afraid to just face true? Wait, what if I told you I'm gay too? Mm. Fuck. What? What? My wish never came true. What if I'm a hypocrite who's afraid to just face true? Wait, what if I told you I'm gay too? Like his whole verse embodies a hypocrite. <laughs> Literally. Literally, bro. Literally, bro. That was dope as shit, bro. Talking about some storytelling out the ass, bro. This was fire as hell, bro. If you like this, man, please like the video. Comment some more Eminem. You may check out in the comment section below. Subscribe so you'll be notified every time your boy drops a video, man. This was Jordan Lucas featuring Eminem. What if I told you I was gay, man? So, hey, without any further ado, hit that subscribe button, and I'm out, man. Thanks for watching.